Hey folks, Brandon Noto from EMSBasics.com. I just wanted to do a quick demonstration of a technique for correcting blood pressure cuffs, which uh, have become out of zero, meaning the needle is no longer pointing at zero. Uh, this is, does not work on every cuff out there, but it does work on a lot of them. Every uh, the ADC type cuffs that you often see on the ambulances. So you go and grab your, your sphygmomanometer or blood pressure cuff, and it looks like this. So instead of pointing at zero, the needle is off. Maybe either it's too high or too low. And in the worst case, you can just use it in what maybe this is maybe uh, ten or twenty points low. So you could take your uh, your reading and then just subtract ten or twenty from what you get. But obviously, that's a pain in the ass. So what you can do is the gauge will just come off of the rubber, and it has this metal flange here, which inserted into the tube. And if you have a pair of pliers or a vice grips, anything along those lines, you can just grasp the metal here and twist it. And often this takes some force, it tends to get stuck. But what you see is when you rotate this, it actually shifts the needle. So just give it a twist until it is sitting at zero again and usually there's a little indicator for where zero should be. And it should work fine. This is obviously not some intrinsic functionality of the device. This is a feature that's been installed for this purpose. So not everyone will have this, especially the, the all-in-one mechanisms where the bulb is included in the gauge. I suspect it tends to uh, not work there, so don't go breaking anything. But if you feel like it's not working, give it a chance because often these do just stick. But uh, as long as you have something like a, a Leatherman, which often people carry, this actually does work pretty well and keeps you from having to just chuck a thing out and get a new one. So something to try, give it a shot, and uh, let me know if you have any questions.